all right hey y'all this is another video on my channel um in this video i am doing my first quick weave for my cousin um i had my mom help me by you know doing the foundation on her hair she wanted a side part so that's the um framework we're going with today um shout out to my mom thank you for helping me with this y'all i do not know how to braid like not like this okay um i do know how to like do you know like box braids or something like that but like i don't know how to braid in the scalp i don't know how to do that and i gotta learn one day so but yes until the meantime my mom got my back shout out to my mom again she does not this braids book with her um we thinking about doing some business things together so just stay tuned but here i am getting started by sewing down her braids mapping out where she wants that side part um we protecting her hair with some wraps and a wig cap and just sewing it down I ain't gonna lie i had to thin this a little bit but it ended up working out and then you know i started gluing the tracks i really wanted to do black with like blonde highlights this came out so so pretty in the end so stay tuned so yes yeah, so here is about the finished result i went ahead and used some heat protectant on her hair and started flattering her hair straight All right, so now I'm about to get started taking down her leave out and getting that straightened. You definitely want to use some heat protectant on her um, natural hair. Um, I do apologize if you guys didn't like how fast the beginning part was. Um, that's why I decided to go ahead and slow it down at this point. Um, but, you know, I'm just trying to save storage on my phone and stuff. So please understand, that's really why I do what I do. Um... But yes, yeah. After mapping out her part, I like to show her her part, let her see if she like it, you know, want it to be moved or anything like that. She said it was good. I'm like, cool. Um, but yes, yeah, so let's talk about some other things, y'all. How y'all been doing? How's life? Um, how's work? How's school? How's your hobbies? I don't know. Um, what's going on? Like Oh, y'all, nothing. My stomach is hanging out in this video. Just ignore that. I know I don't got that much of some stomach, but it's enough to me. And, y'all, yeah, I don't know why I didn't put my shirt down, but I was just getting too comfortable. And here is me doing her edges, doing the baby hairs. Got to swoop the swoop. Um, We love that.
All right, so one thing that I am learning about hair is like, you know, everybody has different hair textures, of course, and so they have a different reaction to different hair products. Um, and I've been noticing that, so I'm just getting used and getting comfortable with just using different products that work on different hair textures. Um, when I was doing her baby hairs, I noticed that it was laying, but it was trying to come up a little bit. So I had to get some reinforcement. I was like, mom, please help me hold this blow dryer. And uh, just please, like, y'all, I feel like doing hair is like a surgical thing. Like, scalpel, edge brush, comb, uh, pliers. Like, that's how I feel about doing hair. But I like it. I really do like it. It is um, becoming a passion of mine. And, you know, I do like the finished result. I like getting cute. And I like making others feel cute. So this is something I really want to get good at so yes y'all and so yes that's one mistake that i noticed and it was another mistake in the beginning when i was um doing her like wig cap and you know sewing it down and stuff um one thing i was just a little nervous about was i couldn't see her part when i was like sewing it down so i was really really nervous and you know of course i didn't want to poke her or anything but like i said i, I ended up finessing it but you know i'm just giving my own self some constructive criticism on what to do better next time so after doing her um baby hairs i went ahead and used some sebastian spray all over the hair just to help with flyaways and then i also used a slick stick on her natural hair just to you know create a better blend with her natural hair and the weave and then after that i used some oil sheen for extra shine also want to shout out my cousin for participating in this video um i really thank you for supporting me everything that i do um and yes girl hopefully we can do this again soon like comment subscribe for more videos like this and definitely follow me on my socials on my tiktok that's where i posted the hair transformation um you can follow me at nisha so silly eight of course, on IG, Nisha Me underscore A. And follow my business page, Nisha's Nails and Beauty. That's Nisha NB0215. Everything's linked in the bio. So, yes, check it out. And I will see y'all later.